I don't know why they make some side ops and some not. Like, Rescue Huey is a side op. Yeah? Yeah. But then that just becomes a story mission, so why is it a side op to begin with? <laughs> oh, that was, that was a bit convenient, wasn't it? I was just thinking about turning off the network. And then it cut out. Yeah. Oh, cool. No! Notifications getting all in my face. You remember one time you just went. Well, it just died. Yeah. Mm. Snake, stop pretending your legs are broken. Snake. Snake! I mean, you wouldn't be pretending. Oh my god! An error has recurred and I've been s signed out of PlayStation Network. I. Well, Do you think anybody yeah. out there who actually thought PlayStation was pronounced PlayStation? Oh fuck, I'm going the wrong way. Alright, well, that's stupid of me. D Dog, don't look at me like that. Let's uh, play some music mentally, shall we? I don't want to set the world on fire. fire. I got just flame thrower and an HEGM Max. And red phosphorus. Took me a while to uh, uh, read Roman numerals for a second there. Um, y a lot of the times when I break into song, you change the lyrics without me being prepared for it. Lots of people do that. Oh God! See you later, D Dog. Oh, there it is. Uh -oh. I've lost all ambition, all worldly acclaim. I, I just, just want, want to be, be the one you love. And with your admission that you'd feel the same. I could kill this guy, it's not actually. <laughs> I could kill this guy by shooting him in the head. I don't want to set the world on fire. Here he comes. I just want to put Ooh, a shot funny. in your head. Get him. Go get him, boy. Get him. Oh, he had no idea. He had no idea. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like that. Doesn't feel so good, does it? I like how the bag disappears with mm. the Fulton in because it was like, wait a minute. You don't have a Fulton. You summon wormholes now. Yeah. That is peculiar. Very peculiar. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, so our objective is probably the same place we get found Huey. Huey so, could probably be Doctor okay. Who now with those wormholes if he wasn't such an asshole. What? He could be a what? I said he could have been Doctor Who now that he has wormhole powers. Could have been Rick. He could have been Rick. Actually, he could probably be Rick again if he wasn't such a coward. Who, Snake? No, um. Huey. Huey. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> what, what if Code Talker became Rick? Like the parasites just got to him. What and turned him into Rick? Yeah. Like changed his physical form? Well, no, just like made him an asshole. He might be an asshole. For all we know, he might just be <laughs> acting nice or. Oh, Code Talker, uh, I don't know, man. What are we doing here? We we have to get the Wabakia. The Wabakia? Yes, the Wabakia snake. The Wabakia seeds. I, I I need them for my parasite research. It's got all the things I need. That's Code Talker. As Rick. I'm 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 literally just letting D Dog do everything. <laughs> He's he should be the new snake. What would they call him? Doggy Snake? <gasps> it still works. What the fuck? Sometimes the polygons don't line up, but the game still recognizes it as a success. Okay. What is he like? Ooh, Ooh, this is just too good. You're, com you're coming home with me, and we're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have not real good fuck time together. <coughs> real good fuck time. No. Is that what you just said? I don't know. Well, oh, there it is. Yeah, I. It's right here. Yeah, there's the AI. Now. It may sound like you're mental, but remember, it's not real, all right? It's just just a machine. Oh God, she's actually quoting Metal Gear Solid Three. Mm-hmm. Prove uh, your loyalty. And Peace Walker. Should I go out here and take this uh, guy out? If you want. 
I do want. That's gonna look so nice at Mother Base, don't you think? It's gonna it's gonna make a lovely like addition to the environment. Okay. I, didn't I don't know why do that. that was funny. Just... <laughs> well, it was sneaky, just... sneaky. Pew. It was yeah. It was just the whole situation. It look, I could have easily just like, what the fuck? You can't take him in there with you. Fine, I'll just wormhole him in the doorway. <laughs> whoa, whoa! <laughs> you just said you were gonna wormhole someone in the doorway. I know exactly what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, look at the photos before you um fallen it off, because I didn't. Oh. She sounds like she's underwater, like in um Oh shit, there's like Huey and there's Huey and there's Huey. He's what the fuck? Can you see that? What? They use the exact same model. Oh in yeah, both yeah, pictures. they did, didn't they? He's uh, very good at posing. Maybe he's like a conspiracy. Hey! Look who it is! Yep. It's Hal! Little Hal. It's Mini Otacon. God, his. His, uh, his, his mother's kind of. Uh, she's alright. I wonder what ever happened to Strangelove. <coughs> I mean, you know what happened to, like, Otacon? Yeah. He was like. He had a relationship. I had a relationship with your mother. Oh shit! It's just going off now? Yep. Oh no, all the photos fell off. That's a nice callback to um yeah, that's why I said look at them first. That's a nice callback to Peace Walker, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it is. Do that's what they all used to do. Do you think the AI pods in Peace Walker like they were um do you think they were the basis for all the AIs in that made up the Patriots? Sorry, I didn't hear what you said. Do you think all the AIs in Peace Walker are all the same AI pods that eventually became the Patriots? <laughs> um, hmm, that's actually an interesting theory. Yeah, because there's four of them, and they're also all named after the US presidents, just like um, the Patriot ones are. This guy came back! That could also explain why they have a... Oh shit! Fuck me! That could also explain why they have an affinity with war, because maybe they were fighting Big Boss and it left a mark on them. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why, but just seeing the icons makes it funny as well. Like, that icon's getting closer to that icon. I know what this means. <laughs> I like how Snake just went, okay, okay, don't go fucking crazy. Okay, so I could stay here, or I could leave. I think I'm gonna leave. Oh, Ashley, could get some materials. Oh, look at all these materials. Mm. Okay, top tip: if you want materials, come here. But for now, we're not going anywhere, so I'm just gonna take this one. Oh yeah, precious material. Yeah, did you know red containers are the best ones? What? They have more stuff in them. Yeah. I didn't know that. Oh, they do. Oh, and he phases. Alchemy. Indeed. Diddy diddy diddy. Didi, 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 didi. How do you took ten minutes? Yeah, it's crazy. We might as well do another mission. We may as well. Maybe. Oh, I'll look how fast that loads. Maybe is. I could do one. Maybe you could do one. Yes. Well, it depends. Oh shit! Is it another side ops I have to do? It is. Oh no! You can do this. S secure the remains of a man on fire. While you're doing this, do you want to listen to um, the new cassette tapes you got as well? Why is he over here? Um, while I'm doing it? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, that's why you're infiltrating. Because that's the idea, isn't it? Basically combining the exposition with the gameplay. Yeah. Which has its pros and cons. Mm. Ooh, I got a message. Isn't that wonderful? Oh, it's Sips. He's gone online. Mm. Tomorrow, you know what I'm going to be doing? Getting your snake costume together? I'm going to try to, yeah. Oh my god, it's actually... What? Is it always zooming like that? What? Is it always zooming in like that even when you're doing just the side ops? Uh... I don't know, it probably does. I don't know why I'm thinking... Otherwise. Well, usually you go on um, regular. Like, how often did you actually just free roam? Just constantly. 
Whenever I wasn't doing, whenever we weren't recording, that's just what I was doing. Mm. Oh, my helicopter is so decked out. I haven't got any armor for it though, so it's weak as shit, but it's really strong. It's mm. like a, it's like a, what do you call them? A glass build. Yeah. Yeah. Which is cool. I like the idea. I like having, of whoever thought that was Point the, the term, term to use. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that's that's a good term. Yes. Makes sense. Cause glass, it's brittle. But well, it can hurt you. Yep, and it's it sharp. Really hurt you. Yeah. Did you see that video of like that guy in Arabia who um, nearly got hit by a giant sheet of glass? Is oh, that... I think I did actually. Yeah, he's just walking down the street, but it just like slid off the side of his arm and smashed. And I don't know where he was going, but he just decided he was going home after that. Oh. Okay. Yeah. He just went. Eh, okay. <laughs> Turned around. It's like. Oh That's... shit! It's this place, isn't it? Yep. It's our favorite. It's um, El Guapo's Fortress. It's Alex's favorite. Yep. I'm pretty. Uh, well, I'm only saying that because it's pretty much the only one he did. Mm-hmm. Oh! Yeah! He is coming with me. No, I don't mean that in the least sexy way possible. You didn't mean that in the least sexy way, sexual way possible. Sexual way. In the most sexual way possible. If you don't want to say the Lee and sexually, just say sexually. Top tip from Andrew. Oh shit, I marked somebody over there as well. Hey, I just realized that's how you get, I mean, not that it's that important, but that's how you get like um, machine guns that are under canopies. You use the wormhole. Yeah. This guy may have just heard me. Okay. Oh, there's a couple of dudes there. Oh, there's a couple of dudes there. Ooh. Christian was a little upset. Well, not upset. Well, kind of upset when he found out this game was <laughs> was set in the eighties. He 80s. was a little upset. Well, not really upset. Well, kind of upset. <laughs> that looked like you were gonna break into song. Yeah, it did a little. But like when you said this was in the eighties, and he got a bit annoyed about all the technology, didn't he? Oh, I think he got more annoyed at the fact that some of the songs actually didn't get released in the eighties. Like what? Um. Shit, what was it? Uh, it was the Cure song, Friday I'm in Love. When Fucking hell! D Dog, you prick! <laughs> <laughs> Look at me! Arr! Arr! <laughs> he just like, huh? What the fuck? What are you doing, D Dog? Okay, don't be stupid. Don't be stupid! Don't be stupid! What are you, some kind of stupid? Please do something, Snake! Take him out! Oh shit, why'd I even do that? I already told him to- You fucking asshole! Stop shooting my dog! It's just you... for my dog! You kick my dog? No. You kick my dog, I kill you! You kick- you shoot my dog? You shoot my dog, I shoot you! In the ass! This is what happens! This is what happens when you fuck stranger in the ass! What are you doing? That's uh... No, 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 not you. This guy. Oh, you fucking pricks. That's it. I'm gonna smoke grenade on your assholes. Uh, I don't think Diamond Dog can attack people in the smoke. What the fuck? Okay, seriously? If you shoot my dog again, I will end you all. And I will not extract you. Even if you are S ranks. Whoa, whoa. Slow down. Okay, that's it. Check it out. Time to multiple CQC these guys! Oh! Consecutive! Eat the floor! Consecutive! Eat the floor! I love it when he used to say that. Yeah. Consecutive! There's even a radio play where um, he beats up a bunch of guys and goes, Consecutive CQC! Yeah. There's also, um. Have you heard that? Well, you can't really hear it. You kind of have to listen to the. It's weird listening to an audio play with subtitles, but. There's a bunch of them for Peace Walker, and there's uh, it shows you how he meets Cars. Yeah. And basically, Cars was um just a regular soldier, just a just a regular old soldier, um who was in charge of a command unit, and he wasn't very good at it because he oh, got shit. he got most of them killed. He also um he was dead sneaky as well. Like Big Boss wanted him on his team because he knew he was a good businessman and a good soldier. 
but he had to sort of convince him. And then Kaz tried to ambush him with a bunch of guys, but Big Boss snuck in, beat up those guys, and got them to join him before they had a chance. And then he basically challenges... You know, like in Bill and Ted, where they keep challenging death to different uh, challenges? Oh, yeah. He does that with Kaz and basically beats him at all of them. Like, um... Eating raw fish and uh oh well that's not fair a snake can pretty much eat anything i know well he didn't know that like he thought he was gonna get him out because he's he's half japanese isn't he so um i think he's eaten sushi before but snake was like you know you gotta eat the entrails and also chew up the parasites real good and everything parasites yeah and miller's like so good y'all they're so tasty are there any more dudes <clears throat> Oh yeah, it was that dude over there. Also, you know that Paz's diary one when she's talking about Snake and Miller beating each other up in the nude? Uh, yeah. I actually never unlocked that cutscene. It wasn't a cutscene. Uh, well, the mission, whatever. Paz's diary. It was in Ground Zeroes. Anyway, um... Yeah, it also does that. And it's kind of gay, but, you know, in a funny way. Yeah. There's even a bit... Where he's pretty, like, pretty much all gay stuff makes me laugh. Is, there's even a bit where he's saying, Boss, you're so hot. Really? Yeah. Oh, right. He's wow. basically having a go at him saying, you know, don't, you know, screw around with so many girls at once. It's not nice. Oh, yeah, because he was like a massive player, wasn't he? Yeah. He's coming too. All right, I'm going to pop these motherfuckers. Whoa, that one was turning and shit. Yeah, that was a little freaky. I was like, is that a thing or not? Okay, these guys. Oh my god, what? Where are these guys? By the way, I would suggest collecting all the minerals before you find the man on fire, because I think you just leave straight away. Really? Yeah, I made that mistake. For what minerals? Just for ones laying about. Yeah. Oh well, I won't bother you about. We don't give you a lot anyway. All right, never mind then. I just thought I should let you know. All right. Can I pick it up with my? Sonar, because I'm picking up some stuff, but I don't know if it's like, you know, remains or whatever. Yeah, probably, yeah. Right, that's a decoy, so I'm not going to bother go there. Um, that's this thing over here. Could that be it? Unless that's another... No, no, that's an animal, isn't it? It's in, it's in the courtyard. What is? The body. It's just straight up in the courtyard? Yeah. What is this, medieval time? Do you just splay the dead <laughs> out there in the middle? Splay out your dead! Totally right! Yeah, I know Deadpool I'm totally right. Deadpool is just laying there. Deadpool. Uh, okay, he's common, so forget that. Did you, oh. get, did you get the codec from Ocelot? What about this? Yeah. It doesn't matter. Power system now. I don't know. The at night. I think it's actually better that you didn't get it. So what do I do? Oh, all right, a fault net. Yeah, wormhole him. I don't know if you have a wormhole right now. Oh, uh, what? Because he actually did change. That would be cool. Yeah, it would. That would be innovative game play. Oh my god, is my foot gonna fit? Oh my god, my foot, my foot is. Oh my god, it's actually kind of stuck. Ah. Okay. That was a phantom pain for you. It was, but not really, because it doesn't hurt anymore. He just stares. It was like, oh my god, you look just like Deadpool. Hmm. Are you Deadpool? Jesus Christ, look at that cleavage. Look at that ass cleavage. <laughs> that's a very slow Folson. None of them have been that kind before. Mm. Well, that's me. That's, it's, it's done. I'm finished. Yep. Man, this Fulton is slow. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We got tiny people. You raised me up, and now I'm gonna kill you. I, this is like the metal version. I totally want to set the world on fire. Oh, shit. I'm actually going against this guy now, aren't I? Maybe. Oh, my dun, God. Dun, 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 How dare you lift me up into the sky? I, I am very angry. I will fuck you up. Okay, maybe he's friendly. I don't think he's friendly. Look at his face. Oh, God. Jesus. 
No, my god, he's gonna fuck snake! <laughs> oh god. The Phantom Pain is coming back. <gasps> that is Volgin! That totally is Volgin! Are you gonna say it? Say Volgin? Well, yeah, because he's got loads of bullets in him. It's so obviously Volgin. Yeah. If you play the original games, you'd know. Is that the boss's horse as well? Maybe. It might be. What's the name? Bashi or something. He looks pretty good for an electrified corpse. Yeah. Oh, he's even got the stars, the Soviet stars in his souls. Hmm. How about that? So no fight for me, I guess. Ah, oh, you know what is a really cool fight? Vulcan. I think Vulcan's battle in Metal Gear Solid 3 is really cool. Yeah, it's a cool one. It's got lots of little uh, tricks to it, hasn't it? Yeah. So was that all in your brain? Who knows? Um. So yeah, there was actually a little thing saying we think the man on fire might be Vulcan. Yeah. But then Who? You, Ocelot says it. All oh, right. It says. We found the man on fire. We have a hunch he might be our old friend Volgan. Oh. Extraction of well, that's cool. He looked a bit too young to be Volgan, though. Yeah. I mean, how old was Vol I don't really know how old Volgan was. Well, he looked Volgan. messed up, didn't he? He looked messed up. Which... And, and he was huge. Yeah. He was huge. I mean, there are some people, ve oh, very few people who can get that huge at like a young age. Mm. Um, but yeah. Because Snake was like in his 30s. when he And he was huge in Metal Gear 3. He's bigger than he is now, I think. Mm. I think maybe his torso is a bit bigger in this, but it's, he had bigger arms. Yeah. I think um, also, because this art style is a little less exaggerated than real life, he's a little less exaggerated. Yeah. In some aspects. Wow. So he survived the Colonel's torture. Hey, look at all the skulls! Oh wait no! Oh, so if that's for him, where do the other skulls I go? I guess you could just get two women and two men. No, maybe maybe they only maybe they only make shells once once you get them. Well, I no, well they already made this one, didn't they? Yeah. Oh, I don't know then. Maybe you only do get women. Wait, you've only got women. Why are you staring at their crotches? I don't know. Wait, what? Do they have tails? No, those are straps or something. Why does everybody have that? Why does everybody have straps no, that makes them look like they have tails? It's probably to attach them to a helicopter or something. Yeah, but Snake has it as well. He doesn't have it now because I'm wearing the Ground Zeroes outfit. Well, yeah, it's probably like to hook himself in whenever he's on a helicopter. It's a bit long for a helicopter hook. Mm, no, like, no. For, for the Snake, it looks like a proper big wolf tail. So yeah, that was the man on fire. It was yeah. cool that you got to be surprised by that. Yeah, I mean, I I always suspected and, it was, you know, it was Volgin. Yeah. Uh, Thing is, I thought it was Volgin the first time I ever saw him, and uh, you know, like when you overthink something and you completely sidestep the obvious. Yeah. Yeah. Because I was all like, what if he's a manifestation of Big Boss's fear and pain and loneliness? But no, he's Volgin. Yeah. I think you tried to psych me out by saying that, didn't you? It was like. Oh, well, I said Furricorn. Furricorn, yeah. Oh, shit, you can give him a skin. <laughs> Furricorn. <laughs> uh, it's like, I want to express, uh, I feel like I'm a horse trapped in a human's body, but you're a horse. I know, but I feel like I'm trapped in a human's body. 